hello guys welcome to my channel again so this video is again in continuation with the already ongoing series so today we are going to work on the last third problem of string domain so uh, before we kick on kick on to this video if you are new to my channel if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please do and let's see uh, what do we have to do in this problem so um, here the gist is like that we will be given a lot of strings depending on the test cases and what we have to do is that uh, we have to remove the duplicates so if we consider this string goodbye bye world 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 so here uh, we have to just print goodbye bye and then world so if you see uh, by is being repeated twice but this by is not considered as duplicate because this is inside a word so it will print goodbye by word right so we have to take in this account and obviously the problem is in uh, related to regex uh, here there is no restrictions uh, for import so obviously you can use linked hash set to do this approach also uh, oh and obviously you have to split the string using spaces and then only you can do it and then you have to join them up right so that would be one approach but they are uh, still referring to reg reg regex I don't know why uh, so let's try to solve this by regex so what we need is first we need need a pattern through which we have to match this and then we have to actually match it right so um, let me show you uh, what we have to do in terms of regex so let me open my notepad real quick so we need a few things so i'll explain uh, why we need it and what are they so first we will need b uh, slash b uh, that is for a boundary so uh, like i said that good by has by inside and then we have by so we have to create a boundary so so that it won't consider by uh, twice in this case right so by is for uh, a word a word boundary and boundaries are actually needed for special cases right so that is the first thing that we require then we need w uh, which is a word character uh, that means a to z small and then it could be capital A to capital Z and then if we just uh, we are doing plus that means we can more uh, we can have it uh, at least one time and it could have also underscore so it will somewhere look like this A to Z and then capital A to capital Z underscore and 0 to 9 right and then we will need um, a non word character also which will be like this so this will be a non uh, word character that is what we had just above negate of that right so you can also write it down as this um, uh, this is the negation and then this right then what we need is we need this so it matches whatever was matched in the first group of the parenthesis so in this case we had this right so this is the case uh, this is the first group so um, this will actually match whatever was matched in the first group of parenthesis of this and then what we need is uh, we need plus which is again uh, for at least one uh, which means one or more times repeated right so if you combine this uh, our regex will somewhere look like this b and then we will need brackets parenthesis whatever you can say right and then what we need is uh, negation right so we will do something like this then 1 then b and then plus so this is what it will look like so let me copy this regex 
if you still have any question feel free to ask on the comment section so what I will do is I will just replace this string here as this and here what we need to do again uh, it requires an explanation so um, we have to replace uh, the group uh, so what we need we have already matched uh, the string with the pattern so what we have to do is we have to check for subsequences of input which we then match with the compiled pattern so that is what we need to do so what I will do is uh, in simpler terms I will try to explain it like um, first let me write it down here what we need to do is am uh, being matcher uh, group is a method for grouping and then we will do m dot group again and here we will do one so here m dot group is the entire match what we got and m dot group uh, let's consider this as i uh, i being the ith match so if we have an entire group we can number them from um, 0 to n uh, not 0 to n 1 to n because here it start from 1 and 1 is the first match which is enclosed in the first set of parentheses so um, here if you require about this question mark and colon so this is added to make it non capturing group meaning um, you cannot do group you cannot uh, do group to get the group for um, like it, this is just for adding uh, you can say uh, faster performance right nothing else so um, let's try to run this first okay I'm getting compilation error uh, insert the current okay I'm missing this and that is why it is creating a problem for me so what we need here is just uh, we have to point out one thing which is pattern and this is also a case scenario I forgot to include this so it will be insensitive right so let's try to run this now okay so it's working right so let me summarize um, each and everything here so slash uh, I think uh, this question is really complicated because regex is not a piece of cake first of all so it might be hard uh, for someone um, initially to get the gist of this but again there, there are more solution to do it like I said linked has set could be one so let's try to submit this code so it's working perfectly good and I just earned my fifth star whoa yeah that was my goal to earn the uh, gold star and it's done now <laughs> but still there are a lot of problems so I'll solve them all one by one so as you can see I removed um, question mark and colon from this string and this is still works so this was for um, you can say efficiency or faster performance but that's not really required and let me explain this entire reg regex one more time so b hi uh, slash b is a word boundary and this is required because we don't want by to be considered as a duplicate we want to create a boundary so that this word can be treated as a word 
and boundaries are actually for special uh, cases so that's why uh, we need this um, slash w plus this is a word character which could be treated as a to z um, like you can see here this w plus uh, is for a non word character which can also be treated like this and slash one it matches whatever was matched in the first group of parentheses and first group of parentheses is this uh, which which is like yeah so plus is for uh, matching whatever it's placed after one or more times so we have parentheses here so it, it will check for one and more times which is at least one time so it will check for repetition and this is what our regex roughly look like so I, you can remove this or add this for uh, more efficiency but uh, I, I would prefer simplicity here and m dot group and m dot group one uh, these are actually for grouping so why we did this is uh, because m dot group is our entire match and we want to replace this with this so what m dot group one is doing is consider this one as i so it is the ith match and here it is the first match right so this is the first match uh, which is enclosed uh, in the parenthesis so if you submit this code it should work fine for you so i hope um, it was clear enough but it was n if if in case it was not feel free to write it down write your query on the comment section i would help help you out and this is it for this video and i just got my gold star which is really good so um, i will meet you in the next video this is it for today so um, see you guys in the next one till then have a good day stay safe and